Welcome to another episode of What Goes Where. In this episode, we will be covering the Battery Storage System Kit, or the BSS Kit. Let's kick off at the inverter. So our first label is the shutdown procedure. This label needs to be placed on the outside of the inverter near the equipment that needs to be operated, like your DC isolator, AC isolator, and battery isolator if that's there as well. Below this label goes your shutdown procedure warning. Uh, we often see this label missed on installations, but it's important that this label is placed below the shutdown procedure on the outside of the inverter. Also at the inverter, we have our warning multiple energy sources label. This is to let you know that there's multiple energy sources, your battery and your solar, and that all isolators need to be operated to shut the system down. Moving on to our switchboard. On the outside of our switchboard, we have our ES label. This is ES3480, which is a lithium ion chemistry number. And that is suitable for most lithium ion batteries on the market today. We also have our warning multiple mode IES label. Now this goes inside the switchboard or any DB to which the inverter is connected, warning that there is a multiple mode uh, inverter attached and there may be um, voltage and power when the system, when the grid is out. We also have our main switch standalone supply label for your circuit breaker. At the actual battery enclosure, we have our battery system voltage labels. Now there's a red one and a white one. So the white one is for batteries where the voltage is below DVCA, and the red one is for batteries where the voltage is above DVCA. This number will be on your um, instructions for your battery, or you can get that from your battery supplier. We also have our danger risk of battery explosion. This needs to be placed adjacent or on the enclosure of the actual battery, whether it be your power wall. Um, we have our danger at toxic fumes, that goes there as well. And then we have our warning arc flash hazard label, which goes on the enclosure of the batteries as well. And last of all, we have our battery system isolator label. So this goes on the isolator that is used to isolate the battery and the storage system. Thanks for watching. Hope that you found that informative. Please note that this label kit is separate to your solar label kit. So this is a BSS only label kit. You need either a DP or a switch kit for the solar side of the system. And this kit is for the battery side of the system. So thanks for watching again. Uh, reach out to us if you have any questions. We'll look forward to seeing you on the next episode. Thank you.